With Amy Wells, I'm Mike Keith, and it's time to go Behind Enemy Lines, presented by Microsoft Teams. We are so pleased to welcome Tyler Dragon, who is with the Cincinnati Inquirer. He covers the Bengals. Thank you for taking time with us. Thanks for having me on. Tyler, I guess the first question I have to ask you is, whenever you are talking about the Cincinnati Bengals to any other person in the world, is the first thing they ask you about every single time Joe Burrow? 100 percent joe burrow is the top athlete in cincinnati and he's only played seven games you know the city's kind of known as a reds town but joe burrow is by far the most popular athlete in cincinnati what has impressed you most about joe burrow's play since you started seeing him with the bengals this season on the field it's his composure in the pocket, his ability to diagnose defenses. Seven different Bengals have at least 13 catches. His accuracy, he's been as good as advertised. He's worth the number one overall pick. So, you know, the Bengals, they do have their franchise quarterback. Now it's up for the team to build around him. As far as making progress, yes, moderate progress, but then you look at the whole AFC North division. The Baltimore Ravens aren't going anywhere. The Pittsburgh Steelers, they're undefeated. And then you have a Cleveland Browns team. So it's moderate progress, but they have a long way to go to be competitive in division, probably another couple years. Talk to me a little bit about the Bengals defense that we're gonna see on Sunday. Who is sticking out for them at this point and who do they need to play well? The Bengals really need their linebackers to step up, Jermaine Pratt, uh, Josh Bynes to kind of shore up that run defense and also on the defensive backfield Von Bell their strong safety who they signed in free agency they need him to step up as well. Tennessee plays at Cincinnati on Sunday kickoff is set for 1202 central time Amy Wells me and the rest of the Titans radio team on the air with Titans countdown at 11 a.m central. Tyler Dragon, thank you so much for taking time with us to go behind enemy lines.